The fourth hole at Pebble Beach is a 331 yard par four and it offers decisions. Are you gonna try to drive this green with a driver? Just 331 yards, I know it's a little uphill, but you can reach this or are you gonna lay up with an iron? Why would you lay up? Well, as we go down here, what you're gonna see is there's a ton of bunkers that guard this fairway and a little bit of water on the right hand side. You must get this ball into the fairway because this green, well, this is the smallest green on the golf course. It's also the most well protected. The par threes at Pebble Beach are some of the best on any golf course that I've ever had the chance to play. It starts here with number five. This is 195 yards. And back in 1998, Jack Nicklaus came along and added a tee box where you hit across Stillwater Cove to this whole location, or this green rather, that is really well protected by bunkers both on the right hand side and in the back left. What you want to do here is you want to play this shot up to the left hand side and then hit a little left to right shot. It'll catch the front portion of the green and it will release back there. A very challenging green, a very challenging shot. And these par threes, I'm promising you, are some of the best that you're going to get a chance to see. Now, 195 over Stillwater Cove. I'm going to take this right at that tree in the back. See if I can't hit a little cut back here. Oh yeah, this is exactly what daddy liked. Yup, I love it. And that right there is the way you play this fifth hole here at Pebble. One of my favorite par threes. The sixth hole is our first par five on the golf course. It's 523 yards. What does that mean? All the players will be able to reach this in two, provided you can get it in the fairway. What's out there in the fairway? Well, there's a bunker down the left-hand side. The rough is obviously going to be very thick, and this fairway releases towards the water once in the fairway. Now you're hitting to a blind green protected by bunkers. It's very accessible, and I think we're going to see a lot of birdies here come U.S. Open. I'm Michael Breed, so excited for the 119th playing of the U.S. Open at Pebble Beach. I'm going to take you through all 18 holes, give you some insights into what the players are going to face, and make it a little bit more enjoyable for you to watch the U.S. Open. All you need to do is click on the link below and subscribe to my YouTube channel.